multiple pregnant women have died due to COVID-19 complications, according to former Health Minister Dr. Dwayne Sands, who is sounding the alarm over the increase in the number of infections among pregnant women and the danger this poses to both the mother and the child. Dr. Sands said in the last week alone, four pregnant women who were admitted to a major maternity facility to give birth tested positive for COVID-19. This was very recently, within the last four days. The minister said those women are not alone, adding that more than 100 women have been in the same situation in the Bahamas. And if you look now between the private sector and the public sector, we have had at least 125 women who have now delivered when they were COVID positive. And we have lost a number of those women. San said this points to a deep problem in society that is now impacting the country's maternal mortality rate, which for years has been relatively low. He added that reckless behavior can ruin what should be some of the most joyous moments in a woman's life. This is a serious problem. And so when people think about, oh, it's no big deal, I am going to go and visit Mary, Sally, Susie, but understand that if a pregnant woman gets infected with COVID, her risk during delivery goes up and the risk of losing that child goes up. So this is not a game. Dr. Sands said pregnant women should consider getting vaccinated. Talk to your managing obstetrician about should you be immunized. There are large international obstetrical societies that have endorsed immunization pre-pregnancy and during pregnancy. Back in June, a five-month-old girl died from COVID-19 on June 26. Since March 2020, more than 15,000 people in the Bahamas have tested positive for COVID-19, and just over 300 people have died. Reporting for the Guardian News Network, I'm Berthony McDermott.